Our next award will be presented by Tad. He is presenting an award to Jean Anthony Ray. Who don't remember fame back in the days? Tad? I don't know if I was actually expecting this, but uh, I thought I was just to receive it. But anyway, uh, we'll start out like this. Uh, Gene Anthony Ray is uh, my nephew, born and raised in Harlem. And every, most of you guys kind of know his story, his history. And uh, again, one of those uh, lucky stars that fell from above and uh, made something of himself, danced his behind off, no you know, formal training, anything like that. And um, kind of the rest is here is history. Uh, I'll say this on behalf of my entire family. A matter of fact, my niece Pearl, come, come. This is Tony's uh, big sister. I'm sorry, I was moving so fast. I forgot to bring her up here with me. Hey, that's some good music right there. Hey, baby, look at me. And tell me what you see. You ain't seen no best of me yet. Give me time, I'll make you forget the rest. That's that fire right there, right? <laughs> That's that fire. But you guys, um, this is Tony's big sister. Uh, Tony is my oldest sister's son, and she had three children. This is my niece, Pearl. She's actually uh, my big niece. I'm actually her little uncle. Um, but yeah, this is my sister Jean's oldest daughter, and Tony is her little brother, and they have another brother, Nairobi. So I'll allow her to come up and accept this award and say something on our family's behalf. Here you go, Pearl. Wow. Wow. Say something. Whew. I love God. You don't love God? What's wrong with you? God is so good. God is absolutely amazing. To be able to put together or to put the thought in the young lady's head, Miss Bunny, I thank you. To know that for all that he, everybody that he touched and everybody who he came in contact with and how he just shared joy and after he passed, I went online and I read stuff five or six years later where people didn't know he was gone and still had wonderful things to say about him. And I still cry, a lot of y'all not, I still cry. He died in 2003 and some days it's just like it was yesterday. Because I miss him, because he was ever present for me. And we always talked about how much we love one another, so I don't miss him because I can't love him, I just miss him because he's not here. For somebody who started dancing, actually he was born feet first, that might have a lot to do with it. <laughs> he was first in the Daily News when he was three. Yes. On the front of the Daily News for dancing in the street. And that's what he lived to do, was dance. And once he had the stroke and he could no longer dance, we knew then that he was not going to no longer live and didn't want to be here. But I thank God because it's important to know that somebody who represented Abundance of stuff in such a short period of time here on this earth. Bunny, I thank you. I mean, I, I can't say it enough. I thank you because I think this is so needed. You know, growing up on 153rd Street and 8th Avenue, that's my stomping ground. I'm born and raised, and I'm here so much. Some people say, did you move back from Georgia? I'm like, no, nope, I still live in Georgia. But I say to you this, my sister, continue the good work. But every time you do this, Please stay in contact because if I can't, if I got to come to New York for something as minor as a cookout, trust me what I tell you. You give me a reason to put some clothes on, to go shopping, <laughs> I'm <laughs> loving this. <laughs> I thank all of y'all so much from the bottom of my heart. Thank you guys. Bunny, I love you. Thank you for everything on behalf of my entire family. I want to thank the Hip Hop Honors. Good night. <laughs> 